That's a little party motion that we had there. So there is the second heat of the girls. Prep were uh, E. Charles Williams and um, Arthur Stewart. Here are our results. Uh, Christian likes Jarrell Richardson, 11.2 seconds, 8 points. Reginald Richardson of Northeast, 11.19 seconds, 6 points. And we follow for the girl. Javante Wilson, Donaldson, 11.32 seconds, 2 points. Joshua Cohen of Bel Air, 11.46 seconds, 1 point. Way in front of the second heat of the girls. Exciting finish there. Okay, so DeAndre Filson, not not logging any points for their teams. DeAndre Filson of Plaquemine, eleven point fifty one points. Saint Helena Central, Brandon Williams, eleven point fifty three points. Uh, eighth place of your Madison Prep Chargers, E. Troy Williams, eleven point fifty five points. Blue Oaks, Christian Walker, 11 point, sorry, 11.55 seconds, I apologize. Um, St. Hilliard Central's Toy Williams, 10th place, 11.59 seconds. Christian Light, 11.68 seconds, 11th place. Cartlin Leary, Bel Air, 11.74 seconds. Northeast's Stephen Williams, 11.78 seconds. Andre Davis, 14th place, Parkview Baptist, 11.86 seconds. Myron Jack of Plaquemine, 15, 15th place, 11.91 seconds. DeAndre Price of Scotlandville, 16 points, a uh, 16th place, 12 seconds even. Your Madison Prep Chargers, Arthur Stewart, in 17th place, 12.04 seconds. Glen Oaks, Stephen Smith, 18th place, 12.26 seconds. Ostrumas, Dante Winfrey, 12.55 seconds. And in 20th place of uh, Tyler Wagesback of Parkview Baptist, 12.61 seconds. DeAndre Jones of Scotlandville did not start in that event. 
So we have now your girls. I don't need a dash results. <clears throat> These are the scoring finals for the girls who scored logged in points for their team. Tori Williams of Blackham in first place, 12.43 seconds, 8 points scored. Takaira Beverly, second place of Scotlandville, 12.47 seconds, 6 points scored. Elena Wire of Baton Rouge Magnet, 12.96 seconds, 4 points scored. That starter's gun was for the boys' 800 meter run. <laughs> Should be on the train, 400 meters, first call, 400 meters dash, first call, 400 meters dash, first call. Back to the girls, 100 meters dash results, Brittany Arnold, 13.01 seconds, 2 points, that's a Plaquemine. And uh, she logged 2 points for Plaquemine. And Glen Oaks, Jamika Scott, 13.07 seconds, that was 1.4 for Glen Oaks. Not logging in any points. Alexis Brown of Bel Air, 13.37 seconds, 6th place, 7th place. Alexandria Henderson, that was made at 13.42 seconds. 8th place, Maya Miles, Donaldsonville, 13.47 seconds. Also in 8th place, Lachey Williams of Scotlandville, 13.47 seconds. Reagan Holloway of Parkview Baptist, 13.87 seconds in 11th place. Joy Rucker of Estrema, 12th place, 14.51 seconds. Um, Jessica Brown of St. Helena Central, 14.73 seconds in 13th place. And in 14th place for your Madison Prep Chargers, Tyler Henderson, 14.77 seconds. so, back to some more results from those 110-meter hurdles. Uh, participating for your Madison Prep Chargers were Joseph Boykins and David Johnson. And here are those results. In first place from those 100-meter hurdles, uh, Aaron Johnson of Northeast, 16.2 seconds, 8 points scored. John Thomas of Scotlandville, 16.89 seconds, 6 points scored. Kaylin De Caleb Domang of Christian Life, 17.24 17 seconds, 4 points scored. Tony Mitchell of Baton Rouge Magnet, 18.32 seconds, uh, 2 points scored. Jordan Johnson of Bel Air, 18.36 seconds, 1 point scored. Joseph Boykins of your Madison Prep Chargers, 19.43 seconds in 6th place, no points. Also no points, 7th place, Neil Scott of Parkview, Parkview Baptist, 20.25 seconds. Uh, John Smith of Bel Air, 8th place, 20.42 seconds. Ninth place, David Johnson of Madison Prep, your Chargers, 20.91 seconds. 10th place, Nathan Turner of Baton Rouge Magnet, 21.58 seconds. And in 11th place, Roderick Scott of Clackamon, 21.89 seconds. So just to bring you up to speed, the boys' team rankings through six events. Northeast in first place with 40 points. Parkview Baptist in second place with 18 points. Scotlandville, the host school, in third place with 16 points. Bel Air tied with Scotlandville, also with 16 points for third place. Christian Life 
uh, 12 points in 5th place. Glen Oaks tied for 5th place also with 12 points. Donaldsonville in 7th place. There's the gun for the second heat of the boys, 800 meters. Donaldsonville in 7th place with 5 points. Baton Rouge Magnet in 8th place with 3 points. Your Madison Prep Chargers in 9th place with 2 points. And Estrella rounding out the boys field in 10th place with 1 point. This young man has got some endurance. Wow! Look at him. He is putting more distance as he comes to the finish line. Nothing is going to get in his way. So uh, the whole school and their Hornets are going to be very, very pleased with that finish. Wow, 1,001, 1,002, more than two seconds in between first and second in that heat. Very impressive. Wow. <laughs> So we now have uh, some more final results in the girls' 100-meter hurdles, uh, scoring points for their teams. Kaylin Jupiter of Donaldsonville, first place, 15.33 seconds, scoring eight points. Delisha McKinley of Scotlandville, I'm oh, sorry, Delisha McKinley of Scotlandville, 16.19 seconds, six points. Chelsea Bales of Parkview Baptist, 19.25 19 seconds, four points scored. Caitlin Purse, uh, Purcell, I hope I pronounced that properly, uh, P-E-R-C-L-E, of Parkview Baptist, 19.56 uh, seconds, two points scored. Morgan Leggett of Bel Air, 21.05 seconds, one point scored. <clears throat> uh, no points scored here. Uh, Amber Harris of Plaquemine, 21.35 <laughs> seconds, um, and not registering any results. Uh, Jelia Jones of Madison Prep, uh, Tyler and Turner of Plaquemine, Christian Jones of Bel Air, and Janisha Henry of Donaldsonville. So, your girls' rankings now from six events scored. Plaquemine and Scotlandville both tied in first place at 28 points. Baton Rouge Magnet, 24 points in third place. Partridge Baptist, uh, 21 points in fourth place. Donaldsonville, 10 points in fifth place. Bel Air, 7 points in sixth place. Glen Oaks is in 7th place with 4 points, and Estruma is in 8th place with 3 points. Results for the girls' 1600 meter run, and that was a marathon. Uh, scoring points for their schools. Uh, first place, Plaquemine with 8 points, Nakiro Gillis. 
uh, with uh, 6 minutes, 6.45 seconds. Stephanie Morris, Baton Rouge Magnet, 6 minutes, 11.32 seconds, 6 points. Paula Mensa, Baton Rouge Magnet, uh, 6 minutes, 25.10 seconds, 4 points. Jamisha Fernandez of Platinum, 6 minutes, 25.45 seconds, 4 points, or 2 points. Ron Drika Jackson of Estruma. Zone one. Six minutes, fifty-one point eighty-four seconds. One point. Zone one. Zone two. two. Not locking any points Zone for their schools. Three. Sixth place, Valerie Williams, Pat Parfu Baptist. Six minutes, fifty-two point eleven seconds. Seventh place, Maze Diederich, Parfu Baptist. That is the girls' reload, which is just underway, folks. Okay. Raven Shields of Scotlandville, 7 minutes, 12.29 seconds in 8th place. Erica Washington of Bel Air, 9th place. Alicia Jenkins of Scotlandville, 10th place. Alexis Webb of Glen Oaks, 11th place. Misha Melton of St. Helena Central, 12th place. Destiny Prevo of Bel Air in 13th place at 8 minutes and 39.3 seconds. Uh, Brenna Elliott of Christian Life, Kiara Dabney of Estruma, and Jerlissa Johnson of Glen Oaks uh, did not start. Uh, some more results in. Just as fast as my lips can run. We have the boys 1600 meter run. And by the way, that, that, that cramped uh, Madison prep runner was uh, Drew Johnson. It's Drew Johnson. Uh, also, Roman Guy did not start for, for the 1600 meter run. Meanwhile, placing points for their team. Glenn McFarland, boy, this, this kid must be one heck of an athlete. Saeed Allen of Glen Oaks with eight points. Four, four minutes and 38.4 seconds in the 1600 meter run. Eight points, eight points for Glen Oaks. Troy Porter of Parkview Baptist, 4 minutes 38.48 seconds, 6 points for Parkview Baptist. Carlos Morgan of Glen Oaks, 4 minutes 59.17 seconds, scoring 4 points. Miguel DeQueer of Scotlandville. Five minutes, four point sixty-two seconds, two points scored. And Leo Freelo of Baton Rouge Magnet, five minutes and six seconds. Five minutes and six point fifty-one seconds, one point for Baton Rouge Magnet. Not logging in any points. Terrell Mason of Donaldsonville, sixth place. Demetrius Franklin of Clackman, seventh place. Jonathan Thomas. Baton Rouge Magnet, 8th place. That is the second heat of the girls' relay. It's the second heat of the girls' relay. And this relay looks like it's going to have an exciting conclusion. Here comes the final length of the relay. We'll get back to those results very shortly. She's got some speed, my goodness. Wow. They got the right person to anchor that to. All right, so rounding up the results. Uh, in uh, ninth place in the boys, 1600, Derek Leonard of Estruma, Brian Augustus of Bel Air in 10th place, Ronald Como of Donaldsonville in 11th place, Dante Young of Bel Air in 12th place, Brandon Barber of Scotlandville in 13th place, Michael Castle. Oh, boy, Michael, 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 Michael Castle of Northeast in 14th place, Dylan Burns of Northeast in 15th place, Jason Brumfield of Estruma 16th place, Jacob Willie of Parkview Baptist in 17th place, and rounding out the field of finishes is Terrence Patterson of Plaquemine at 6 minutes and 18.06 seconds. Again, Drew Johnson was the young man who cramped up early and Roman Guy did not start.
Okay, so back to uh, more results on uh, Louisiana All-American Sports. We have the boys' triple jump results. This was from much earlier. This was right when we started the broadcast. Meanwhile, before we get into those, uh, looks like the boys' 400-meter relay is about to get on the way. Now, we do have Madison Prep in this one. Cannot see the runners from here, but I will try to give you the best bird's eye view I can. And, wow, somebody is just trucking it. Let's see who that is. That is... Is that Scotland, though? Can't tell. Madison Prep, though, keeping very close chase. Charger fans, we might have one here. We might have one here. Here we go. I think that's... Corey uh, Brumfield hands off. Here we go. Here comes Prep. Folks, we, have, we might have a dog in this hunt. Oh, yeah. Here come the Chargers, baby. Here come the Chargers. They're running it out. They're running it out. Oh, it's going to be a photo finish. I think the Chargers may have finished in first place in that event, folks. So we might have uh, put some skins on the wall. I can see Corey Brumfield. That was the person who had it off third. That's, I believe that's Corey Brum Brumfield walking it off. Did not see who finished up for the Chargers, but we will get that uh, information to you very, very shortly. What a fantastic finish. And, folks, I believe your Chargers did pick up first place in a very, very badly needed eight points as well.